Hi, I'm Mitch Gallagher from Sweetwater. The Electrovoice RE20 is one of those instantly recognizable microphones. We've all seen and heard this iconic microphone a million times used in broadcast as well as on kick drum and other sources in the studio. And in fact, you're hearing it on this video today. It's a versatile microphone that's been on the market for more than 50 years. The EVRE20 first hit the market back in 1968, though the Electrovoice company has roots that reach back to the late 1920s right here in Indiana at Notre Dame in South Bend. They started primarily as a live sound company and made microphones for their own use. Some rumors credit the great Newt Rockney for inspiring the name of the company because he referred to their sound systems as his electric voice. In 1934, Al Kahn, one of the founders of the company, invented a major breakthrough for microphones, the humbucking coil, which dramatically solved noise problems. Con and Lou Burroughs, the other founder of the company, also developed new ways to stretch dynamic microphone diaphragms. Both of these technologies gave Electrovoice a real advantage as a microphone manufacturer at that time. Over the years, they introduced a number of game-changing innovations, such as coatings for the aluminum microphone diaphragms that improve sound quality. The company continued to grow at a rapid pace through the Great Depression and as a mic supplier to the military in World War II, as well as to NASA and the space program. As I mentioned, in 1968, EV unveiled the RE20, and it almost immediately became a studio and broadcast standard because of its great sound quality, its ability to handle low-frequency information, and EV's proprietary variable D technology, which controls excessive boominess and bass boost resulting from proximity effect when you're close to the microphone. This allowed the microphones to be used very close up by broadcasters, and it made it very effective on kick drum, bass, and other sources. The RE20 is an end address large diaphragm dynamic microphone, which means that it doesn't require external phantom power to operate. It uses a moving coil of wire connected to a diaphragm to generate its sound. Because of its simple mechanical design, the RE20 is incredibly rugged. It'll handle just about any abuse. It has a cardioid polar pattern, which means that it has basically a three-dimensional heart-shaped pickup pattern with the focus to the front of the microphone. It rejects sound well from behind as well as from the sides. Now, a great feature of the RE20 is that the off-axis response, which means sound coming in from the sides and the back of the microphones, is uncolored. So what sound is picked up from in the room still sounds great. The mic has a heavy-duty internal pop, wind, and blast filter to control P-pops and other plosives. Again, this makes it great for close-up use by broadcasters and podcasters. There's also internal shock mounting to reduce handling noise. The RE20 uses EV's proprietary acoustic alloy, or acoustic alloy, for its diaphragm, and that's that coated aluminum material I mentioned earlier. This is extremely low mass, yet quite rugged, so you get great detail while still being able to handle high sound pressure levels. Because the diaphragm is coated, it functions well even under adverse conditions such as high humidity and temperature. The integral humbucking coil cuts down on hum and noise, and the steel housing also helps shield the mic from noise pickup. We've got frequency response from 45 hertz to 18 kilohertz, which is fairly wide for a dynamic microphone, and this helps with capturing detail with great clarity and articulation. Now some breaking news for you. Traditionally, the RE20 was available in sort of a silver color, but Electrovoice has recently released the RE20 in black, which is the color we have here today. This sleek new color really helps the mic disappear visually for video production, on stage, or for content creators. So where can you use an RE20? It's tough to find a mic that sounds better for spoken word for broadcast, podcast, gaming, or streaming. As I mentioned, I'm using it for this video today. Another default use for the RE20 is on kick drum in the studio, as well as on floor tom. But don't be afraid to try the RE20 in just about every source. I've seen it used for low brass, trombone, electric bass amp, upright bass, electric guitar cabinets, and even acoustic instruments. It also makes a great mic for certain vocal styles, such as heavy male vocals. One of the beauties of the RE20 is that it's just a straight-ahead, simple microphone. All we have is a bass roll-off switch for tapering down the bottom end if needed. So you just point the RE20 at the source, find the best spot for placing the mic, and hit record. Because of the variable D technology in the microphone, it controls proximity effects so well, you can place the RE20 right up close, closer than you would with other large diaphragm mics, and still get a clear, tight sound. Being able to place it this close dramatically increases the RE20's isolation from picking up room noise and bleed from other sources. The RE20 is a mic that will allow you to get into action making music or broadcasting very quickly without interrupting your creative flow. I hope you've enjoyed this look at Electrovoice's venerable RE20 large diaphragm dynamic microphone. It's a mic that belongs in literally every studio mic locker as well as in stage rigs. If you're looking for a great voice mic for broadcast or podcast, this is it. 
If you need a versatile dynamic mic for recording drums, acoustic or electric bass, guitar, brass, and even voice, the RE20 deserves your consideration. You'll find it will become your go-to mic for many situations. To learn more about the RE20 and other Electrovoice products, contact your Sweetwater sales engineer or visit Sweetwater.com. Thanks for joining me today. I'm Mitch Gallagher from Sweetwater. Thanks for watching. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Click here for more videos like this or start at Sweetwater.com for all your music instrument and pro audio needs.